My role is that of an audience strategist. I help different marketing and communications teams figure out who their target audience should be and how best to reach and engage them in order to grow their businesses. I was not always in marketing. Coming out of college, I actually worked in financial services for a few years because that is what I studied. After spending a few years in that field, I actually decided that I was curious about marketing and strategy and what was actually driving some of the numbers that I was responsible for reporting and analyzing. That led me to go to business school. So I did earn my MBA with a concentration in marketing, sustainable enterprise, and also a certificate in nonprofit leadership. And coming out of business school, I actually spent a number of years working for different consumer products companies within their brand management function. I then transitioned into a consumer technology company. And then my last transition was just a couple of years ago where I came over to the agency side. I have no regrets about any of the moves that I've made. I have been able to meet incredible people along the way, to push myself to always be learning and things of that nature. But I will say, you know, if you would have asked me 10 years ago, 15 years ago, if I saw myself in the role that I'm in now, I probably would have said no. The reason for that is my mother actually was an admin at the New York Stock Exchange when I was growing up. And so I was overly exposed to financial services as a young, impressionable child. And that is what sparked my curiosity around business and finance to begin with. I didn't know any other marketers. It just became something that I was intellectually curious about down the line and was um, made aware of an organization called the Consortium for Graduate Study and Management when I was thinking about going to business school. Their entire mission is to change the face of leadership by creating access to opportunities for underrepresented minorities to get funding to get their MBA and then also to gain employment at some of the top companies and brands around the world. And so by way of the consortium, I was able to kind of be exposed to this entire new world of opportunities opportunities and business careers, and I'm so grateful for that. If I could give advice to my younger self, always be curious, continue to learn. Learning does not stop when you leave school. We have brains that should be constantly consuming information and inspiration so that we can continue to grow and develop. The other thing I would say is embrace change. I've moved across the country five times. While that is a lot, I would say you will meet the most unique people Ever. And it's so good to meet people who grew up differently from you, who come from different backgrounds and have different curiosities and perks about them. And then the last thing is make sure that you have hobbies and interests because that is how you will continue to push yourself to learn new skills and then also to meet new people and grow your network.